Um, you know, it's a pretty good <laughs> Yeah, pricey I don't even ticket. think we put all of our money together. We still couldn't no. afford to go out. <laughs> not even in coach, I think. <laughs> no, no, not at all. But hey, this morning, though, a little fog that's gone away. Right now, we're clear sky, 64 degrees. Pretty nice this lunch hour. Dew points drop into 30 now. We are dealing with some chilly temperatures working the way back in tonight, but at least it's dry out there. Live look, this is Rainbow City camera here, our Barron Critical Institute camera there. Look at the colors of the hillside there over there in Etowah County. Looking pretty nice. We'll take you also, it's keeping it in Etowah County. Right now, toward Atala. Had a lot of fog this morning here. Things are looking pretty nice and pretty sunny out your way as well, too. Up there nearby, Gatson, 64, 65 here in Asheville area. Back to Anniston. Birmingham again, 64, 70. Jasper, Tuscaloosa, one of the cool spots, 62. Temperatures are 13 degrees colder right now there compared to yesterday at the same time. We're about 9 degrees colder as that front was knocking at our door at lunchtime yesterday. Now we're clear as high pressure moves off to the east of us. This is what's called a trough. You see this dash line to our west. That's going to be a leading edge. Just some colder air. It's going to bring a reinforcing shot of that colder air to Birmingham as we head into tomorrow. So, today, if you want to do a little bit of raking the leaves after they all fell yesterday with the rain and wind, yeah, we're looking at temperatures 64 at noon, but 70. Or 62 there by 4 o'clock. 7 o'clock, you start raking leaves a little dark outside, but temperatures in the 50s. No rain all the way through Tuesday. That'll be very welcome. And you can see here throughout the day today, we're looking at 67 or high. Getting to the mid 50s by 6 o'clock tonight. Again, the high school football game is a little chilly by the time they end. 40s across much of the area by 10 o'clock. There's that little trough moving through, bringing us that cooler air. Tomorrow morning, how about 32, 38 degrees from uh, Coleman back to the Birmingham area? 38 Tuscaloosa as well. And then tomorrow, Afternoon, we only briefly get to about 52 degrees out there before temperatures quickly fall back to the 40s by 6 o'clock on Saturday evening. And then Saturday night into Sunday, check it out 32 here in Birmingham, 29 over in Asheville, 30 for just about many other areas. So we are talking at or below freezing, and I think we'll see more 20s than what this shows. So there's a freeze watch in effect from Saturday 9 p.m. to Sunday 8 a.m. So we're talking about really freezing temperatures out there. And by the way, average first freeze in Birmingham, November 9th. So we're just a few days beyond that. So, overall, not too late on the scale there. So, your weekend will have some sunshine 52 and 59 degrees. New Mexico State headed to Tuscaloosa, 49 to 11 a.m. kickoff there, only getting to the lower 50s. And Mississippi State heading to Auburn. Yeah, my Bulldogs taking on the Tigers, though, 50s for the game there at 11 a.m. UAB is headed up to Marshall, where temperatures will be in the 40s and 30s there. And Sanford headed down to Florida, being the 70s for that game, a little bit warmer there. And Miles playing for the championship. How about that? Temperatures fall from the 50s to the 40s. With that two o'clock kickoff here in Birmingham. So, how about 52 and 32 Sunday morning? But we do get back to the 60s with sunshine next week. Dave, thanks. Ahead, the holiday shopping season already in full swing.